the healing power of lemons! <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I am your humble narrator, and welcome back to Awesome Knots. Uh, I realized that I had only done one episode for Voltar, and I'm not as sucky as I was when I first did that episode, so we're gonna revisit Mr. Voltar the Omniscient. Um, obviously I got the extra droid creation, which is a really, really nice thing. I like to make the droids fire faster and fly faster, and then uh, increase the explosion. So you can do some really, really nice burst damage with Voltar. Um, another great thing that I would say is completely necessary is to pick up the, uh, was it Nightmares or something like that? The one that increases the damage of your healing wave. That is extremely important. We've got a, a Leon and a Ulip. So that is going to be an interesting matchup, I do believe. Oh, we've got a Rocco and a Leon. That's a little better, I suppose. Um, Ulip would mean another support, which I'm not a fan of. <laughs> Two supports on the team, you're, you're kind of asking for trouble. But I'm going to, yeah, keep this, keep this Rocco and Leon healed. And meanwhile, just kind of try and stay in the middle of the battle enough for my droids to do some stuff. Um, obviously I did fire off just a couple of them there, but, uh, yeah. Voltar's kind of a passive character, as you may have guessed. He, he just does mostly healing shenanigans, and then, um, most of his damage can be done just by standing near stuff, which I think is really, really cool. You can concentrate mostly on, um, oh my god, I can't believe I just missed that Chucho. <laughs> he had no life and he just kind of crept up near me. Um, but yeah, it allows you to concentrate mostly on navigating away from the enemies, uh, keeping yourself safe and things like that. So that is extremely important. Ooh. And there, uh, Chucho was able to stick Leon. Luckily, my healing powers are awesome. And, uh, I'll keep you on your feet, buddy. That's fine. You want some? Here you go. <laughs> I was waiting for him to do, like, a, a heal me dance. <laughs> It's always my favorite. I'm like, ha ha ha, you need me. Which really, nobody needs Voltar, but he's always nice to have on the team. Definitely increases that pushing power, healing the droids up and things like that. And look at that, that top turret is almost down. They haven't even scratched, scratched our top turret. So uh, I'm, I'm feeling pretty hopeful for this match. They've got Deadlift and Skoldier, which uh, is not necessarily a great matchup, especially when you're facing a Rocco who can just kind of kite you around the map. Uh, even Chucho is relatively short range. So our team makeup on paper, I would say, is better than theirs. Uh, usually you would prefer something that can tank. Um, but yeah, we've got Leon who can clone spam and things like this. Usually ends up pretty okay. Ooh. I'm kind of scared of that uh, Chucho. I was hoping I could just pick him off. If I had the drone explosion upgrade, damage upgrade, then uh, I would definitely be doing enough damage to take him down. But that's okay. That's just fine. I don't have my uh, nightmares yet either. I do need to make a trip back to base at some point. But that is another uh, issue that I find with Voltar. It's just you're always at full health. You always have your little heal bot to uh, get you back to full health. So I never find much of a need to go back to base. I just spent most of my droids uh, nuking that guy. Which wasn't really a nuke because uh, he had to shield up through most of it. But that's okay. Here comes the Chucho from behind. He is not hitting those sticky bombs really well. Uh, our Leon is doing exceedingly well. I really like uh, Leon, even though he's kind of been nerfed with his, uh, his stealth business going away. Um, yeah, he's, he's a fine melee character even without stealth, so we're going to uh, back him up with Voltar. He's kind of going to act as our tank, and uh, hopefully it's going to work out just fine. There's some more healing for the droids, keep them stuck on that turret, and they are in pretty poor health compared to our team. The healing power of Voltar, the healing power of lemons! <laughs> He's got a lemon for a head. He's a lemon head. He's a delicious candy man. <laughs> I haven't been bottom lane uh, all match, so I'm gonna go ahead and try and see what's going on down here. Hey guys, you wanna get your bottom turret pushed in? That sounds awesome. Unfortunately, the Leon did miss that uh, 
that heal bot, but it worked out okay. I got a kill in, and that's always the most important thing, isn't it? Yes, it is. The deadlift is going to teleport away. I would really like to get some um, damage on this heal bot, but first things first, I got to go home, get my uh, nightmares up. Probably some more uh, attack speed and flight speed for the droids. Uh, droids are generally the first thing that I'll upgrade. That is the uh, number of droids first, attack speed and s flight speed second, and then explosion damage finally. Uh, and it works out relatively well. Usually you want to stick uh, nightmares in there somewhere. Ooh, that was a nice little heal. Uh, I'm kind of scared to go in there though. I'm gonna get this health bubble. That's what I'm gonna do. Voltar can heal himself. All right. And you'll notice the uh, droids are shooting way faster now, chewing things up significantly harder, especially with that extra droid in the mix. So that is nice. And we are going to kill this Chucho. Or, I guess the Leon will kill the Chucho. As long as he's dead. That's all that matters. Um, I'm not going to be salty or anything. I'm a little bit salty. <laughs> I was able to uh, peel this Skull Deer off the turret relatively quickly. Basically, yeah, staying near Voltar at all when he has this droid upgrade is not a good idea. If Voltar can keep himself up with his heal bot, then you are going to go down. And then adding the damage to the heal bot is just uh, even more of a bonus. It's super, super nice. There goes the bottom turret. Easily done with Voltar, the master. Master Blaster. So, Skullgear kind of threw me back, but it didn't work out well for him. I'm gonna try and get this Leon healed up just a little bit. And, uh, we're best friends forever. I don't know where the fuck that Rocco is or what he's doing, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Me and me and Leon are going 2v3 on this shit. <laughs> and Rocco kind of lets an arrow in every so often, but... Overall, um, I'd say the Rocco's not doing too great. Um, my humble opinion. But, you know, I'm sure it would be a lot harder without him. So, oh, get the Chucho! Oh, nope. Unless you're firing the droids, it's really hard to uh, to just rely on auto attacks to, to kill people. But that's that's fine. We're doing good. We're pushing hard, and uh, they're obviously having quite a difficult time pushing back against Voltar. Voltar is absolutely, um, yeah, one of the most dangerous classes. If I see one on the opposing team, I'm like, oh fuck. It's gonna be a hard match, I'll tell you what. And, uh, I'm proving that today. I think in my last video I only got one kill with Voltar, which was, uh, not the greatest showcase. I hope that we can up that a little more in this episode. Uh, but it's looking like maybe not. There I'm trying to spam and get the kill for ya. But, um, yeah. Deadlift is a hard one to take care of. And there's my heal. I'm gonna leave now. Goodbye! And I love Voltar's uh, floaty nature. Boom! Come on, kill! Get it! Where'd the where'd the deadlift go? No, he's got no health. Oh god! Oh my lord! That's not good. Please, please, heal bot. Oh, wow! That was close. That was really close. Oh, I thought I was gonna die from uh, Skulldeer's earthquake dot. That's fine. I got the health bubble, but I will continue going back into base just because uh, I got more upgrades. This is my opportunity uh, that I don't get very often to just take a break from the battlefield, buy a, a couple of upgrades, which is, um, yeah, really necessary. If you're not buying upgrades, then you're gonna suck. Doesn't matter how much solar you have if you're not spending it. So, as you can see here, uh, doing some massive, massive damage with the droids flying around, but it was not quite enough to take anyone down. I needed some backup there. That's okay. Gentlemen, let us commence ourselves. I, I really enjoy the uh, the German accent of Voltar. I think you've got Yuri, who has a Russian accent. You've got Deadlift, who has a sort of a, a southern accent. Just all the Awesome Nuts characters always have a great personality. Dizzy and Froggy G, both kind of like ghetto man and woman. But it works out relatively well, um, even there, because Dizzy's more of a singer, Froggy's more of a rapper. You see? You see? They're different. <laughs> Not really, though. I'm going to uh, assist the Leon here. Oh my god. That worked out pretty good. 
That wasn't even the real Leon. <laughs> I was tricked by his clone. I'm his teammate and I got tricked by his clone. That's fucking ridiculous. Oh well, whatever. Got the kill on the Skull Deer, so we are going to be doing better than the uh, 1 and 0 that I got last episode. I guess technically 2 and 1 is still not extremely great, but I'll take it, that's for sure. And let's see, we can get this. Oh, come here, buddy. Dang. Dang! I don't want to let the Super Droid uh, have a field day with my turret, so I'm not going to chase that deadlift down too much further. Come on, chew this fucking thing up. God. I'm trying to keep the droids pushed back. There we go. Now the team's all together. Good job. Follow me down here. Help me out with something. And I got stuck, but that's okay. Um, Leon's looking a little shitty too. Everything's fine. Everything's awesome. They are just so tanky. Um, on paper, yeah, I, I might think that they would win. It's it's extremely hard to deal with um, Skull Deer and Deadlift together. Fortunately, you don't see them together too often. Mostly seeing Chucho uh, playing the team game. And there was another kill on the Chucho. He was just waiting for my, uh, my droids to eat him alive, basically. Or for his sticky beak bomb to go off. And here, trying to get rid of the Skull Deer. It's not working too well, though. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. They got our bottom turret. That's fine. It happens from time to time. But we're going to have to push even harder in order to get into their base and uh, finish them off. This match could go either way at this point. So, um, yeah. I think Leon can backdoor relatively easy. They have the uh, the top lane completely open now, so uh, I might recommend that he do that at some point if this match goes on for too long. But first, I would uh, like to rack up some kills. So there's Chucho and Skull Deer trying to pinch us off. Um, I did go after the Skull Deer because he was lower on health, but yeah. Chucho's relatively easy to, to chew up as well. So I'm not too worried about that. There's the Rocco. He gets some heals. And uh, I guess they're chasing the Leon around, which is never a good idea because he can turn invisible and shit. That doesn't make much sense. Uh, and here's Chucho without his motorbike. Alright. He ran away. He did the smart thing. Really without his bike, he's, uh, he's lunch for Voltar because Voltar has a really, really high damage output. He can definitely stick him and... Uh, heal off the sticky bomb damage pretty nicely. Uh, so we've got Leon pushing forward. This Chucho back again in my face. So let's see what we can do. Yes, yes, get the deadlift. Oh man, tried to stick it too hard. So far we're just uh, doing a bit of an exchange. One kill then die, one kill then die, one kill then die. Three and two is uh, not a fantastic score. I would like to see something a little bit better, but um, yeah, Voltar is a support class, so for me to be getting any kills, especially with Leon on the team, I'm pretty excited for that. Um, yeah, and it's really nice to have the, uh, the droids at my beck and call. Oh my god. I didn't expect to see all three of those dudes up here. So let's see what we can do. Anything at all? Get rid of the motorbike? Okay. <laughs> Our only kill was Ramona, who is uh, Chucho's motorbike. And I gotta stay away from my team. There we go. A little bit of healing, anybody? Anybody? That was the clone Leon again. I, I can't even tell my, my teammate from, from the clone teammate. Oh, get him. Help me out, Leon. I'm with you, bro. Oh, damn. Okay, see you later. I gotta go. Here's some heals. Really nice. And now our base apparently under attack. Not very nice. Okay, get the health bubble. Push, 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 push. I didn't notice our bottom turret go down, um, which is not, which is not good on my part. Honestly, you should always have an eye on your turrets. But um, yeah, obviously didn't notice it happen or. Uh, didn't register. Maybe I did see it. Maybe I was right there. And yeah. I know I ran through the bottom once, so it basically just didn't register in my brain that that's what was happening. And 
hopefully that Leon's gonna get away. We'll get this Chucho. Yes, mind over matter. How's that? You have your motorbike with you? No. Then stay away. Their bottom turret is almost done for. Um, gonna try and push in here. See if I can make it happen. Nope, Skulldeer is there. Skulldeer is always there. He is in the right place at the right time. Um, I'm seeing relatively little of deadlift. Not a fantastic deadlift. We did some great deadlifting last week, uh, if you want to go check that out. Maybe learn a little bit on how to play some deadlift. Um, you know, not that I'm the best or something, because he only came out like a month ago. But uh, I do relatively well. So we've got our whole team in here. We're going to try and work this fucking turret. Skulldeer. Oh, now deadlift. Well, I hope I don't die. There we go. Excellent. <laughs> Just uh, a hasty a hasty retreat. Let's heal this Rocco back up so he can stay in the fight. And he did hit that Chucho with the arrow, uh, which was pretty nice. I think the Chucho was already behind the turret, maybe. So, good job, Rocco. And I'm gonna try and heal him while he uh, tanks the turret, but... You know that shit ain't gonna work. You need, like, a Clunk or Deadlift or Skulldeer. Our, our team is relatively soft and squishy, um, except for Leon's clones, which, you know, don't really matter and stuff like that. Um, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to make sure my birdie doesn't die. Don't kill my birdie! We've got fucking uh, one bar left on that turret. So I'm relatively hopeful that we're going to get their last turret down before they get our last turret down. But again, the the turrets don't really matter. We both have a, a way to get into each other's bases at the moment, but uh, we're still somewhat at a standstill, which I find pretty interesting. I don't know if, um, if it's on purpose or anything. I guess not, because, uh, yeah, Chucho's in our base now. Oh, Chucho and Deadlift. All right. Hello, boys. And I'm gonna try and chew this Chucho apart. There we go. Dayton does took the lead in kills. Finally, we're breaking that uh, that curse. We're at five and two now instead of three and two, which is really, really nice. Get my uh, killing spree going with one more kill. I'd really like that. Voltar's killing spree music is just the best. The best ever. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and try and push in the top a little more. Maybe distract them somewhat and then drop down to the bottom. Very nice. That turret is gone. Skulldeer's almost dead from the Leon. I'll give him some heals. And we are going to chew this base up. That, uh, that damage from Leon is just absolutely insane, as always. I'm trying to get myself away from my teammates and droids. Oh god damn it, no killing spree today. <laughs> Okay, I'm the brain of the operation, so, uh, Leon, go ahead, backdoor this shit. That's how it's gonna have to end, I think, because this top turret is coming down for sure. Obviously, I got the pushback pulse on my, uh, healing, healing bot, but I don't know how far that's gonna take me necessarily, especially against a team that is indeed so tanky. Oh my god. Tried to push back the droids with my bot, and it did not work at all got destroyed, so I'll grab the health bubble. Let's try and pinch these guys on the bottom one more time. Very nice. Very nice. How's that? Oh, What a dick. And there's Deadlift using the, uh, the leap to escape, mostly. Which I guess is okay. Leon says he's going back door now, so this match should be over relatively shortly. Um, I don't necessarily want to get caught up in here. They've got Chucho's bike posted as a somewhat of a turret. It really doesn't do that much damage. Um, I think it's more of a mental case than anything. Uh, there can be damage upgrades for the bike, but generally people don't go for it because you'd rather upgrade the character that you're actually playing instead of just uh, a bike, a non-sentient character that stays where you place it. Although that can be really useful as well. There's my healing pulse, bumping back the uh, the deadlift, and boom! Take that skull deer down. Get my revenge. Very nice. Um, yeah, 
I thought we were gonna get that deadlift, but he's obviously got some upgrades to his uh, protective shield, which is okay. I I suppose it's late enough in the game that it's conceivable he could have bought them, but um, yeah, it's always kind of annoying. <laughs> To say the very least about it. Luckily that sticky bomb didn't hit my droids. Um, it looks like Leon's in there already. So he's he's distracting them relatively well. We're just going to try and back him up a little bit and see what happens. Oh, my health bubble. <laughs> Come on. Get him. Oh, I didn't get him. Run! Everybody run! I tried to knock them back with the healing pulse, it didn't really work. But, uh, Rocco's not scared. He ain't never scared. Oh god, please don't die. He died. <laughs> oh my god, I just spit everywhere too. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, just kind of trying to avoid the chucho and uh, wait for Leon to make his second entrance. It's really nice to have a stealthy character, especially in uh, these close kind of matches. Because really, this could go either way. We've got one bar left on our top turret. I don't like that at all. And uh, I just destroyed Ramona one more time. Wonderfully done. Oh god. I thought it was just Chucho, but Scoldio showed up there too. Alright. Get my heal on. This is my base is under attack, but I ain't gonna let that happen. Push the droids, push the droids. And there's Leon in the back. He's doing some stuff. He's causing some shenanigans. I really like uh, Leon or Ksenia basically for the end of the game and they can just sneak into the enemy's base and do as they please. It's really, really nice and uh, a pretty good way to, to end up winning the game in my experience. Um, quite a useful character. Otherwise, you got to go in with all three of your people, but if you've got a Leon or Ksenia, you can basically leave a couple people at home and uh, let them do their work. So anyways, friends, there he is. GG's all around. <laughs> this has been Awesome Nuts, friends. I've been Brandon Davey, a humble narrator. I sincerely hope you enjoyed this episode with Volta, the omniscient. He is an amazing, amazing uh, pusher, supporter, everything, really. Uh, once you get him upgraded, he does a massive amount of damage as well. So. It says he's hard, but he's not that hard. Just just follow the Dayton does way. Upgrade your droids first, then your healing thing, and then your heal bot. Your healing wave, and then your heal bot. Yeah, that's what I mean to say. Anyways, I hope that you like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the video, found any of this helpful, that is always appreciated. Helps the channel to get out there, which is something that I really, really like when I see uh, numbers going up. You know, I'm just, I'm just a big fan of numbers, and bigger numbers makes me even more happy, so. I hope you can help me out with that. You already did just by watching this, and especially by watching this bar. So thank you so, 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 so much, especially uh, you that are seeing this, actually seeing this, and didn't click away in the first five minutes. <laughs> uh, anyways, friends, I appreciate your support. I appreciate your likes, comments, subscriptions, all that stuff. But most of all, I appreciate you. You are a unique and spectacular person. And uh, thank you for watching what it does. Sincerely. I will see you in the next one, friends. Thanks so much for watching, and until then, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See you, my friend.